Hi. Alright, so I have this uh, 16 by 50 inch sheet of 316 stainless. 4 inch pipe. I'm going to be cutting this into 4 by 4 squares, so I'll be able to get 4 wide, 12 and a half, so I'm going to call it 12, so I'll be able to get 48 different plates out of this sheet. And then I will stack them horizontally inside this tube. And that's the plan. All the squares marked out. Ready to cut. all of these cut. I'm just going to take the chop saw and then whack each one of these into four pieces. Here's all the pieces cut. Now I just got to take them and clean up the edges. So I said I was going to use a 4 inch piece, but I feel like that's a lot of material to cut off. A lot of wasted material. So I'm going to be using a 6 inch. I have some 6 inch laying around, so I'm going to use that and do something like this. I'll have the neutral plates, and then I'll have the charge plates positive and negative turned a little bit. So that's kind of the concept. Just uh, kind of stray away from having to chop so much material off. I want to see what this produces first. Well, the design is evolving a little bit as I'm building it. So I mock this up just to get a good measurement of how tall it is. So I think what I want to do is run a strap from here all the way around and then connect the positive and negative with straps like this. I was just going to have the corner sticking out and then use some threaded rod. Um, but I will be able to use this extra piece that I had left over from the sheet. Cut this into different straps and then I should have enough to bend it around and over. And hopefully that will work. If I have the spare piece all marked up, I'm going to cut nine different pieces for the straps that I need. And I mocked up some washers to show how this will be held together. I'll be using some threaded rod through. I was just going to use one through the center, but now I'm going to use two. That'll stabilize the sections a little bit better too. And I'll be able to have a strap go from the top, out, around, and then down, and then I'll be able to bolt everything together. Alright, so all the plates are cut, straps are cut. I kind of shit the bed a little bit on this one when I cut it. Cut it too small. I went off the marking on the back side instead of the side I should have used, so I'll have to try to make that work. Um, everything's cut, so now I'm just going to go through and use some sandpaper and scuff both sides of these and come back later and see what they look like. While I'm working on that, leave a comment, let me know what you think of the project. If you like the video, like the video. If you want to see more of this kind of stuff, uh, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell so you can see more. Take some time to check out some of the other videos. Thanks for watching.